Today, I'm going to be talking about what to do when she says she needs space. So your wife says to you, she needs space. She wants to move out or wants you to move out, whatever the situation is. What do you do? If you are meeting me for the very first time, my name is Ade Sobanjo and I help men hit their goals in marriage. Christian men, you love the Lord. You're doing well in the ministry. You're doing well in your workplace. But you do not like the way things are going in your marriage. I help you turn that around. And if your marriage is already in trouble, your wife already says, I need space. I help you recover it without much pain and in the shortest time possible. Your wife says, I need space. What do you do? Let's start with what you should not do. Many things that many people do, do not help the marriage. I can group all of them in into this. Do not try to control your wife's behavior in the situation. So that's, that's what I would put it as a general category for this behavior. If you try to control her behavior, you're going to mess things up. For example, if you decide to beg her, as you beg, you're making her feel that you don't care about her feelings. You only think about your experience and your feelings. If you get mad at her, then you're only reinforcing the reason why she wanted to leave anyway, that you are always making her afraid. You're always trying to intimidate her. And so that doesn't work. If you say, let's drag you to your mother and explain to her what you have done, or maybe you think of doing that without her, it's the same feeling. You're trying to control her. You don't care about what she says. You don't respect her judgment. If you bring them to your own relatives, then you are trying to intimidate her, ridicule her, and make her look like the bad person. If you report her to your pastor, the same thing happens. Of course, there's a way you can bring her to the pastor and say, you know what, I think I've done wrong. And my wife has decided to walk away. I couldn't, I, I'm really so sorry that I didn't listen to her all this while. Please, could you speak to us so that I can hear what she's saying? Yes, you could do that. And that would not really backfire on you. But most people that go to the pastor, that's not what they say. Most times, the reason that many men reach out to, to get help at this time is to control the wife to change, make her change our views. Now that doesn't work. So don't do that. Do not do anything that will try to control her actions. Now do not, do not try to find out what, uh, where are you going to stay? Who are you going to stay with? Don't do that either. Rather do this, recognize that you have been ignorant of the pain that she felt. You have been, um, you have underestimated how hurt she is and that you want to change. So the key is to say, I'm going to change and I understand. So once you decide not to, once you know not to do those things, the next thing you need to do is then accept that she can move. She can get space. How Find out how she wants to do it. Take your time to find out, okay, how do you want to execute this move? Number two. Accept that, okay, you need space. I'm, I trust you. You are, you are a matured person. You know where you want to do. You want to have space or you've thought about this. How are we going to do that? How are we going to do that? Now, in doing, in, in asking that, you're giving her room to tell, talk more. Many times when a woman says to you, I want more space, I want to leave, she's not saying that she wants the marriage to be completely broken. She's just saying that I need to do something drastic to get your attention. And so if you respond and say, wow, you got my attention now, it helps. Now, the goal of that is not to make her stay for that day, but to get her to know that, yes, she got your attention and there, 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 there will be hope if you follow through with all of this that I'm sharing with you. So you, the, you, your wife has already said she wants to move. You have learned that you're not going to, she wants some space. You have learned that you're not going to try to control her behavior. You've accepted, that's number three, you've accepted now that, um, yes, you can go how do you want to go about it. 
number three and then you're going forward and saying you know what i'm not going to try to track you or find out where you are or know about that give you the confidence to do that the next thing you want to talk about then is opening the door for her to come back and sometimes some people do some very weird stuff you say things that makes it difficult to reconcile don't do that don't make it difficult for her to come back so let the door remain open and the way you do that is by saying i understand how you must have felt i cannot know all of it but i for you to say you want to leave you want some space it must be that you have been really hurt i want to make changes i'm going to make changes and i would uh, if you can help or if you whenever you feel comfortable to give me more information and support i'll be willing to learn and to hear from you so that way you've opened the door you opened the door of communication you've also opened the door of getting help from her to move forward you need to do that right away right away right from the moment she says i need space you need to go ahead and let that door be open to a reconciliation because you are a child of god as a child of god you are a representative of god in her life so is she to you god has made you a team one team of two people and and because you are a team of two god is willing to uh, to use you to bless her and use her to bless you so when you notice that she doesn't want to be in that team anymore it becomes your responsibility to work it out such that she can be part of the team and you can continue to do the work together whatever it is that will make you to have communications with her very important why is that important because if you are not communicating with her you don't have reason to interact with her she's not going to see that you're changing you need to have reasons to communicate if you have children together and you're sharing and she says in this space you're going to say yes okay i understand uh, can I have the children for sometimes? And once that is in, sp in place, you're going to have the children sometimes. Your interactions about the children would show her the kind of spirit that you have, the difference in you. And as you work hard on yourself, these things will begin to reflect. And sometimes we give you prompts and things that you need to say to even emphasize the transformation that's happening in you but you need to find a way to make sure that there is communication between you now of course you have the right to try to talk to her and find her and speak a lot to her do not do that don't push don't go initiating communication about relationship what you do at this time is allow her to be the one that initiates let her initiate and let her lead but tell her about the children tell her about things that involve her if you're still doing finances together talk to her about that but let your love your confidence your your peace that it come out through those experiences because as she leads and she notices the difference in you she may ask for more she may begin to feel safer with you and uh, not as hopeless as she was when she said she needed space to think and so if you are still watching this and it has helped you please let me know in the comments what would you suggest that someone should do in this case maybe there are some things that i've ignored or that i didn't talk about maybe you made those mistakes in the past let me know in the comments let me know please like the video subscribe to the channel if you want to connect with me you, you feel that this is something that you would like to get help on then go to my website adisubanja.com slash apply i will give you 15 minutes of my time to look over your marriage and see what we need to do if you are a good fit for my program i would invite you to it otherwise i will tell you exactly what you can do just like i shared with you today and tweak it for, for you personally and we can move on from there